Conventional wisdom recommends simplifying a model prior to analyzing it so that your analysis will run faster. Also, if you're using Creo Simulate Lite, you have a limitation of 200 surfaces, which also might require you to remove features in order to be able to run the analysis. Most people recommend using the suppress feature, which will temporarily delete the feature from your model. The problem with suppress is that it affects parent-child relationships. So if you suppress a feature that has children, Creo Parametric wants to suppress the children as well as the parent. I recommend a different approach. I recommend part simplified reps. Most people aren't aware that you can create simplified representations at the part level as well. And for the most part, they're not necessary. Back in the 80s and 90s, when computers didn't have much RAM, you needed every trick in the book in order to be able to load certain parts and assemblies. And I suspect with additive manufacturing resulting in more complex parts, with patterns with hundreds or thousands of instances, they might make a comeback. To create a part simplified rep, you go to the view manager and then you click the new button. And I like to call my simplified rep for analysis, analysis. And then you hit the enter key and you're going to get the menu manager with four different choices in here. But the one that you'll probably use is features. And when you choose features, then you'll usually leave the default exclude and pick which features you no longer want in here. So for example, I've got an odd around feature here that removes some non-structural mass. And let me hold down the control key and select these chamfers over here. Then we'll click OK and then Done. And those features are no longer in the model. Here you can see that we get a column in the model tree that indicates that they are excluded. And with that, I can then jump over into simulate and perform my analysis. And I want to mention one other technique. On the bottom side of this part, there are some rounds here and I figure that they're probably not going to affect the results of the analysis that I'm going to perform. The problem is, is that these actually aren't round features. There are some basically fillets that were created inside of this extrude feature. So I'm not able to use a suppress or simplified rep in order to remove them from the model. In this case, you can go to the flexible modeling tab and then select those surfaces. I'm using the control key to select them and then click on the remove command and then hit the check mark. And now those quasi fillets are no longer in the model. By the way, from the editing drop down menu in the model tab, there's also a remove command that does essentially the same thing. So now that our model is simplified, we're ready for analysis. I hope you like this video. For more information, please visit www.creowindchill.com. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button to be informed when new videos are uploaded. Thank you.